G'day, I'm John Tarot, and today I'm here to talk about food heaven and food hell. The nation was asked, what's their favorite food? We made up a list, it's called food heaven. What was the food they don't like to eat? We made up a list and it's called food hell. And I think in my, my whole world, I think that most food actually comes from heaven. Some of it comes from hell. But the people at BBC Good Food have decided to publish this great survey and I tell you what, there's some interesting findings. Number one on food hell list is liver, which I think is quite interesting actually because liver comes in many forms. I love chicken livers. I think they're delicious, quickly fried, brilliant with fettuccine and a little bit of chili. As far as calves liver, I think slice it really, really thinly, loads of onion, loads of bacon, and don't serve a lot of it, but lots of mashed potatoes. I think the world has gone a little bit crazy because in food hell, number two on the list is fish. Fish has bones, let's be fair about it. But the thing is, I think most people are overcooking fish. Cook the fish for half as long as you think it needs to be cooked for. If you think, ah, a piece of fish needs to be cooked for 10 minutes, cook it just for five. Honestly, it'll be far, far better. And let it sit to one side while you get everything else ready. It has to be said that the nation is not a fan of Brussels sprouts. Number three on the hell list is Brussels sprouts. However, if they are just shaved or sliced very, very thinly and cooked in a mixture of a little bit of butter and a little bit of water for about 10 minutes with lots and lots of pepper and served in small quantities, they can be delicious. Actually, I'll tell you what, Brussels, Brussels sprout coleslaw is a fine, fine thing. How mushrooms are made onto the food hell list, I have absolutely no idea. Mushrooms in any way, shape or form, I'd be very, very happy with. On pizza, I think they are fantastic. Whole big mushrooms underneath the grill with garlic butter, grilled until they're lovely and soft, served with toast and a, and a soft boiled egg, a fantastic thing. But if you don't like the mushrooms, that's your problem. Give them to me and I'll eat the whole lot. The crazy nation that we are has decided that food heaven and food hell, there are, there are foods on both lists. Both pasta is on food heaven and food hell, as is curry. Curry on food heaven and on food hell, it shows that the nation is divided, that we now see that curry is the nation's new marmite. You either love it or you hate it, but the simple fact is curry is here to stay, as is pasta.